What's up, YouTubers? Today I'm gonna make a video on how to burn uh, MP4 disk. Sometimes it may work with MKV files. So the two programs you're gonna need are DVD Flick and Image Burn. Those are the only two programs you'll need. And this is the movie I'm gonna be burning. Hold on. Okay, so once I have my two movies here, you're going to click on DVD Flick. So when that opens up, what you're going to do, make sure this is an MP4 movie. So here's my MP4 movie. I'm going to drag it onto here. Then once that's there, I'm going to bring my other movie. Wait for it. Right. Okay, once that's done, what you're going to want to do next is go on Project Settings and just name the project. So I'm going to name this Superman Movies. Okay. Make sure you put a blank DVD R movie or DVD rip, and then you make sure you select. Uh, 4.3 gigs DVD so then you click on video just leave how this is leave how that is leave how that is now in order for this to play on a DVD player or a TV you're gonna have to do this burn project to disk that's it then you're gonna have to rename that again Make sure that's selected as well. I'll change that to six times. Uh, check this and check that. So then you're gonna click accept. And then click on menu settings. You can click. You can choose any one you want. You can click that, click that, click that. I'm just gonna use a simple white. Then what you're gonna do next is just create DVD. Um, then you click OK, then it should be done. It may take about six hours to burn, and um, I know that seems like a pretty long time, so you just gotta wait, but it works. Um, image burn, you're probably wondering why would you need that. That's actually to burn the file to the disk. Like once this encoding and all that stuff is done, when that reaches 100% on the finalized, then the image burn will open up and start burning. So that's my video, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, remember to leave a like or a